vitamin D level and the COVID symptom severity. Today we're going to look at a paper that that basically uh, is a scientific report and just published three days ago in looking at the real data, how the correlation between uh, vitamin D level and uh, the COVID symptoms. Okay, so it's a six week study and they recruit around 100, 150-ish COVID patients of age group between 30 and 60 years. And the groups is distributed like this. They have two groups. One is group A. Group A, all are asymptomatic COVID patients. Uh, in total, there are 91 people. And the group B, uh, the patients, they require ICU admissions. There are 63 of them. And the next step is they look into their vitamin D label. And they found out the group B has a significantly higher vitamin D level than group B. It's very significant. You, you can see the, the group A has 27, around almost 28 NG uh, per ml vitamin D. And the group B, D, group B uh, just uh, has an average of 14, uh, which is just around half of the uh, what group B have, that's uh, significantly lower than that. So the conclusion so far is, um, at least from this report, is saying that if you have not enough uh, vitamin D in your blood, then that person will be more likely to have severe symptoms. And they also look into the vitamin D deficiency uh, if you look at the, how many people has uh, deficiency in vitamin D, there's only 30, around 33% of them uh, are deficient in vitamin D. On the contrary, 96, almost 97% of patients in group B are deficient in vitamin D. So there's a very strong correlation between vitamin D deficiency and the COVID uh, severe symptoms. So that's their uh, conclusion from this report. I think that's a very uh, informative report. I highly recommend you to to look at it. And I put a link, I'll put a link of the paper, of the scientific report papers in the description down below if you would like to uh, check it out and feel free. That's a very important thing. Um yeah, I'm planning to uh, release more scientific paper reviews or videos about COVID-19 in the future. So if you would like to receive more videos related to that, don't forget to subscribe. Your subscription is my greatest support to make more videos like this. And other than that, I will see you next time.